possibly lose whoever we vote for. That may not be true, but that is the political mantra of the day. Thank you, Brian. From living rooms to tap rooms, people of all political persuasions gathered to watch the debate. Much of the crowd at the five spot on Queen Anne Hill was glued to the TVs throughout the night. But what if you haven't picked a side yet? Como Force Lindsay Cohen watched the face off with some undecided voters. Face to face for the first time. In a room at the Como headquarters, a group of about a dozen undecided voters sit and watch and wait. Few visible responses during the debates and little changes in their minds apparently afterwards. How many of you thought there was a clear winner in this debate? I thought Romney was a clear winner because uh, before he's made me uncomfortable. And today he seemed actually open, empathetic, sincere. Just a single person in the group thought one of the candidates walked away a winner tonight. Although at least one voter here said what she saw solidified how she will probably vote in November. It definitely, I think it cemented um, how I feel because I, I tend to disagree with Romney's view on the decentralization of the federal government or, you know, giving more power to the states. While Romney talked of giving states more power when it comes to education, his stance on health care resonated with one viewer who works in the industry. My particular concern was the, the lack of facts. Uh, the bottom line is that uh, 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 Medicare is actually an incredibly efficient way of providing health care to a large number of our seniors. And uh, I, I don't think we should form our opinions based on some ideology of hating the federal government or what the federal government does. A group of undecided voters who tonight are mostly undecided when it comes to who they'll vote for, although there are clear thoughts on what they'd like to hear from the candidates moving forward. I thought it was the president's uh, debate to lose. Um, I didn't think he was as strong as I was expecting him to be. I thought he would be the stronger debater. Um, I do feel like uh, Romney got away with an awful lot of statements that seemed um, a little vague. In Seattle, Lindsay Cohen Como, 4 News. Shortly after the debate, I asked Sam Donaldson of ABC News if the candidate.